Your presence is peace, and your presence is the fullness of joy. I thank you, God. You're worthy, Jesus. You're worthy, Jesus. You're worthy, Jesus. You're worthy, Jesus. His presence is peace. I spent half my life searching for that peace in other I went to math, I went to drugs, I went to sex, I went to everything else trying to find peace and nothing gave me peace. It just distracted me from the fact I didn't have peace. But when I encountered Jesus and his love for me, it changed me from the inside out. His presence wrecked me. His presence changed me. That peace I was searching for and everything else, I realized I was made for his presence. I was searching for his presence. And his presence is the only thing that could satisfy the longing of the soul. You were created for joy. You were created to be loved. You were created for the presence of God. And the only thing that can satisfy your soul is the presence of God. There's no sin in the world that could fill that void. But Jesus can. You know, this is uh, known as the living. Come on, baby. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. But I thank you for that peace to flood this world, for your presence to flood this world. We were known all around the world for riots and fires. 100 years straight, absolutely. Yeah, that's the You know, we just want you to know today that there's a God who loves you. He loves you so much. Hey, you can you gonna grab some food? Way. And yet the most important way, God the Father gave his only begotten son. There's nothing greater he could have gave. No greater sacrifice. You know, in his holy, pure, sinless life, he became your sin at the cross. That you might come to know his righteousness in your life. Meaning you're going to exchange your sinful life for his holy life. And come to the joy of your salvation. Come to the victory that your name is written in the Lamb's Book of Life. You can be absolute free today because the Bible testifies who the Son of God sets free is free indeed. He has the power to do that. He's the King of all kings and the Lord of all glory. And in Him, there is nothing that is impossible. And the Bible says,